Go Wild is over. May has started, and we have got to get back on track with this budget. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Rochelle and if this is your first time watching one of my videos, I talk about planning, fragrance, body care, and budgeting, and pretty much anything else that I feel like talking about. So if any of that seems interesting to you, then go ahead and click on that subscribe button, but don't stop there. Make sure that you turn on your notification bell so that you don't miss whenever I do upload a new video. If you enjoy my content, of course, if you are already a subscriber, thank you. You are greatly appreciated. So y'all, we gotta get this budget back on track. So in this video today, I'm going to be setting up my budget for the month of May as much as I possibly can. So let me explain. Now, we are, we are out of our black ink in the printer. So I wasn't able to print out um, my budget by paychecks bill trackers. So I cannot put those trackers in here yet. Um, I'm going to go ahead and order some ink once I get done with this video. Hopefully, it'll be here before Friday. Today is Tuesday, May the 7th, that I am filming this video. Hopefully, it should go up tomorrow, Wednesday, May the 8th. So, let me just go ahead and take this out. Okay, do I need to take these pages out? No. I need to take this gum out, though. Okay. So, y'all, we're going to be setting up, like I said, we're going to be setting up my budget for the month of May, I almost said April, for the month of May, I am going to, where is it? Notate my priorities for the month, notate any important reminders for the month, um, and put down my bills here, and then show y'all my different trackers, cause y'all, we gotta get back on track. Now I have here, I don't know what you call this my little pouch from Erin Condren I don't I do not remember the name of this pattern here I'm just gonna take out my sharpie S gel pen so that we can go ahead and get started with notating all of my bills and before I do that let me flip here to the front of my um, planner. Jeez, I, why are my words escaping me? Flip to the front of my planner and grab my monthly bill tracker. Y'all, I made this on Canva. So um, if you have the, and I have the pro version, if you have the free version, I, I'm pretty sure you can do this as well. But just note that, excuse me, that there are certain features that the pro version has that the free version doesn't have. Okay. So I made this on Canva. And as you can see here, I need to redo this. That's what I need to do. However, like I said, I gotta get some, we gotta get some more black, um, black ink, black toner. So that way I can finish up my setting up everything for the month. Woo, it seems like y'all, it seems like that we go through so much toner. It's unreal. So let's see here, for my priorities, we're gonna start here with my currently page. I'm gonna use my currently page for my priorities for the month. And they're gonna be the same priorities that they were that they were in January, February, and March and April, but I just didn't notate them. Now it's been a minute since I've done a budgeting video. So like I said, we gotta get back on track. Like for real, for real, for real. Okay, so the first priority, for May is to tie, I keep looking back here because I have it down here, is I want to ensure that I tithe weekly. Y'all, we wanna make sure that our blessings keep coming. I am a tither, um, I'm a Christian, and so I believe in giving back to God that 20% 
plus an offering. So I want to make sure that I tithe weekly. Now, I'm not going to say that I have not ever like not tithe because that has happened. Um, you know, when your faith gets low and you have more bills than month, you know, this can, can kind of slip by the wayside. But that's why we're trying to get back on track so that I can ensure that I continue to tithe weekly. And then the next priority is I want to save at least $200 in my online savings. So save at least $200 in my online savings account. Okay. And then for the third priority, and I have not been doing well with this one either, I want to make sure that I contribute to at least two savings challenges. Contribute. Can y'all see that? Sorry if you couldn't. Let me move this. Contribute to at least two savings. Or saving challenges. That should be saving challenges. Okay. All right. So we have our priorities there. Okay, y'all. So for this category here over import over here under importance, I still have not done this. And I had this written down back in January. Okay, what I need to do is add Ryan's student discount to Amazon so that way I'm not paying $16.23 so that way I think it's like $7.99 for student discount so I need to make sure I do that this month and let's see so update my Amazon so update Amazon I gotta take this out because my hand is hitting my disks. Update Amazon account, meaning add Ryan's student discount. And y'all, she will be home from college on Thursday. So I don't have to call her. And you know what? That little booker was supposed to call me tonight. So that way we could finish up talking about her living arrangements for the fall. See, she's going to wait again. And I don't know what she's doing. There, Y'all know how college students are. I really need to set up my 100 envelope challenge um, box. I need to get, I need to do that. Even if I don't contribute this month, at least get it set up. And, you know, that's not going to be hard. It's just the fact that me just going to get the items that I need and set it up. That's it. And number three, I don't want to have too many um, important, thing, important items listed here. So have at least, I like this at least, have at least 10 no spend days this month, okay? That is what I want to have. Now, down here in this noted section, you know what I need to put down here? I was going to say or explain to y'all that this is going to be for things that come up during the month that I know that... I may have to throw some money at. So May is the month of graduation. So we do our friends, the twins are graduating. So I need to put back or put aside some money for their graduation gift. Okay, so take note. Let's see. Um, number one, twins graduation. So I need to get cards and send 
money. Also, it's Mother's Day. Well, Mother's Day is this uh, on Sunday. So I need to... And y'all, I have the cards. I just haven't sent them yet. Jeez, for my grandma and my mom. So mail, cards, and gifts. So what I'm going to do here is... You know what? My mama watches my video, so I'm not going to say here what I'm going to do. Okay. So, y'all, I've got the cards. I just need to take the time out, sit down, write inside the cards, tape them up, and put my stamps on them and send them and mail them. That's what I need to do. But since I waited, like I said, now I had said, that I was going to do this a week ago. But guess what? I never got around to it. I just didn't do it. Just being lazy and procrastinating. <sighs> so now I'm not going to send them USPS. I'm going to send them by FedEx. So that way they will get there at least by, if I do it, if I go to FedEx tomorrow, which is Wednesday, and I do two two-day overnight, they should get there by Friday, at least Saturday morning. So by me procrastinating, instead of it costing me, what, 37, 38 cents, however much it costs for a stamp uh, to send my cards, it's not going to cost me, I want to say at least like $7 a piece because they're going to different addresses. Okay. So let's see here. Twins graduations, Mother's Day. Um, cards and I need to get my car looked at car maintenance I'm not saying I'm gonna go ahead and get it fixed but I need to get it looked at so that way I'll know what needs to be done and how much it's gonna cost okay before I you know start trying to throw money at my car maintenance okay so those are my priorities i need to make sure i tithe weekly save at least 200 dollars in my online savings account contribute to at least two savings challenges priorities important for the month i need to update my amazon account meaning i need to add ryan student discount because i'm about to pay or i probably already paid it's probably already came out as a matter of fact it did so you see i missed out on that um, savings there. I need to update. Let me zoom out. Okay, I need to uh, update my Amazon account so that way I'm not. I'm just. I'm paying half of this price here. I need to make my 100 envelope challenge box and just contribute to that. And I want to have at least 10 no spend days this month. Y'all think that's doable? I think it's doable. So now we're going to flip to my monthly pages here. And I said I was going to use, do I want to use this or do I want to use my red pen? Where is my red pen? Because that's what I did in February. I don't even know, do I have it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Nope, that ain't it. Maybe it's in here. She's not in here. Y'all, I'll be back. Okay, y'all. I found my red pen. Guess where it was? In my pouch. So, I found it. So, now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to come in and I'm going to notate my bills on each day of the month. And then, I'm going to play some music for y'all while I do this. And then, we'll be back to talk about it.
It's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again, but you ain't picking your phone up. Why are you messing my head up? Any night, any day, let me take you away. All I need is just saying, yeah, 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 yeah. Better nights, better days. When you're here with me, babe, cause you're all that I crave, so I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me when I need you most. We got love guaranteed, and I have to know, say. All right, y'all. So we've got all of the bills written down. I just copied them from my bill tracker here and placed them over here. Now I'm going to go ahead and put this back in its spot here in the front. Is this where this goes? Where does it go? Right here. I think it goes here. Maybe not. Okay. All right, so we have that there. Let's flip back to the monthly page. Where is it? For May. And now I want to notate my paydays. So y'all, I do not have um, this personal loan here due every Friday. It's just that I'm going to pay something every Friday so that way I can go ahead and get it paid off and this month it's called what is it called a magic month because I have five paydays this month I get paid weekly so every Friday is when I get paid and so yeah, so I get paid five times. I don't think, well, not I don't think, I know I'm not gonna get paid anything from YouTube this month because y'all, I have not been as consistent as I should have been. So I didn't make the threshold um, to get paid on the 21st as I wish I was going to be. So yeah. So that what that's what happens when you know you pussy foot around and you don't grind like you're supposed to. That's what happened. Um, YouTube doesn't really show your videos um, to the audience like you would like them to, and so mine aren't getting shared as much and then it also to the algorithm as well and also when you don't have a lot of engagement that's why it's so important to like um, and comment on your favorite content creators videos just to show that feedback because it helps more than you know look at this y'all it helps out a lot the engagement for um for youtube that's why you know i ask i try not to put a lot of ads on my videos but when you guys watch the ads and you like my videos even if you dislike the video any type of engagement um means a lot because it's showing youtube that my videos are worth being shown on y'all's home pages and um, to be watched. So yeah. So please, please, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, um, any engagement, if, um, you know, when the ads play, if you could watch the ads, I really, 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 truly appreciate it if you guys would watch the ads. I know sometimes, now if they're like 
15, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. I don't expect y'all to watch those ads, but the little bit of short ones, if you have it in your heart to watch those ads, I would truly, truly, and greatly appreciate it. Okay, y'all. So I was going to put something else down here. I can't remember what it was. Um, I didn't put the personal loan amounts in here yet. Um, just because, like I said, I'm going to be paying extra and I don't know those extra amounts just yet. I have to do that, play that by ear week by week. Okay. Oh, what I was going to do, I was going to put in my work days. Should I put that in here? Yeah, I will. I'll just put work. Um, eight to four thirty and then work. 8 to 4.30. Yep. And then, oh, you know what? Let me go back here because I have some things that's going to contribute to my spending. So, writer grooming. On the 18th, 5.18. I think it's at nine o'clock nine or ten and then i have a wax appointment on the 19th oh what time is it i don't know yet it's on my phone so he's grooming my wax appointment and then um work 18, 8 30 to no, 8 to 4 30, and then on 5 25, 8 to 4 30. Okay, and then let's see here. So that's Cinco de Mayo, and then we're off for Memorial Day. So, is that everything? I think that is that I need to notate. So, let's come in and put some stuff in my sidebar. I need some motivational stuff to go on my sidebar. Okay, we got our no spin. I want to put the no spins in, but then I also want to put like a quote. And my sidebar as well. Not those though. I want to keep the place for my um, my no spin challenges. I can tell you right now, this month or this week is not going to be good unless I like start today. Um, I mean, I guess I could. Yeah, I could start today, which is you. We'll start tomorrow, Wednesday. Okay, where is my other? Okay, I have this budget sticker book here. There's some things in here that I could use. I know there's some quotes. Okay, here we go. Girls just want to have fun. You got this. I've got skills to pay the bills. Kindness costs nothing. Save now, spend later. I just want to get to a place financially where adding guac isn't a big decision. A budget is telling your money where to go instead of wondering where it went. Learn how to see the possibility, not the problem. Me, oh, I need this bank account. No, you don't. Right? Me, should I buy this brain? No, no, no. Me, sold. I need to find hobbies that don't include using my debit card. That is so true. So, 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 so true. Okay, which one? Let's use this one. A budget is telling your money where to go instead of wondering where it went. Instead of wondering, W-O-N-D-R-I-N-G. -I, I think I said wandering. We're not wandering anywhere. Okay, let's bring this up. Because, is that how I did it? 
I know I had to be up high. Yeah. Okay, now that's crooked, but it's okay. All right, so we have that. The budget is telling your money where to go instead of wondering where it went. We're not wandering anywhere. Not W-A-N-D-E-R-I-N-G. Wondering, W-O-N. Okay. We're gonna put these no spins down. No spin challenges. So we're gonna put this one here. And I will be back to check in with y'all when I do my weekly expense tracking. That's when we'll look at my no spins. How many I had, how I did for my no spins challenges. Now, if there are bills that are due, that doesn't count. I should have mixed those up. It's okay. Let's put this one here. this one down here okay so we have those there and there was one I know that there I saw some words like some motivational quotes not in this one so it had to be in this accessory book I don't know if they make accessory books anymore, y'all. Me, should I buy a brain? No, no. Okay, I already saw that one. What's your favorite childhood memory? Not paying bills. Exactly. Exactly. Was that it? Just those? Seriously? Where can I put this at? I need something to go that way. Well, you know what? I'm not gonna use any. Um... Oh, I got some of these I could use. Okay, my no spin challenges. Okay. All right, y'all. So we've got our no spin stickers down and our bills on the days that they're due. Now what I'll do is I'll come back. Um, now these have already been paid because like I said, it's the seventh. So up to the seventh, these bills have already been paid. And then, yeah, and so that's how it's gonna go the rest of the month. Okay, and so let's look, let's flip back here to the tab this week. I don't know if y'all can see that. And so here's my cash planning sheet here. So I'll put the date down. You guys know you've seen this. My date, the date down, my cash envelopes, um, the category and the amounts of cash breakdown. So I have those in there. So I did not track my expenses for this week, but like I said, I'm using, I'm repurposing my sheets. I'm not gonna throw this away. So I'll just come in and redate this for this week and another cash plan so i need to print more but like i said i need to order my i need to order some ink okay so okay i think i need one more one more week so four weeks total of this of these sheets here and then i need my actual paycheck budgets for each week so i need four of those but when i come back to do my budget check-in and my my budget check-in and tracking my expenses, I'll put those in at that time. So I would do that with y'all as well. And is that everything? I think so. I think that's it, y'all, for setting up my budget for the month of May. Like I said, we did my currently page, did the priorities. Just, I'm just doing a recap. I did the my priorities for the month, wrote down what's important, and then anything that I need to remember that's going to cost money additional in addition to my bills that I have written here on the monthly pages, I wanted to take note of that as well. Okay, so I did that there. We got all of our bills written down, got our paydays noted, and then 
the motivation quote here and then our no spin challenge stickers and then our cash planning and weekly expense tracker sheets minus the budget the paycheck budget sheets and y'all that is it i hope you all enjoy getting to see how i set up my detailed budget for the month what things i'm going to be saving for um putting down like my no spin challenges and looking at my priorities and what's important for the month. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if y'all are on your budgeting journey as well. We just need to just converse in the comment section, um, in the comments. So yeah, have y'all set y'all's budget up? How are y'all doing on y'all debt-free journey? Let's talk about it. So again, I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me over on Instagram at just Rochelle W. And thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys.